The Maine Department of Corrections has been serving the state for nearly 200 years and offers several different career opportunities and paths. These opportunities include field training officer, correctional care and treatment worker, evidence response team, special operations group, inner perimeter security team, canine handler, the honor guard, and firearms training officer. Well, first and foremost, uh, we're, we're there for the families, and it's uh, whether it be the actual officer or the families, uh, immediate family members of the officers. The honor guard will um, do whatever is asked during funeral processions, and we do graduations, we do promotions, we do parades, uh, or any other function where the presentation of uh, the American flag and the state flag is presented. The uh, correctional officer will have to um, have to learn how to salute. We'll have to learn how to march. We'll have to learn how to mark time march. We'll have to how to do turns. They and and then that's done through practice. To be uh, qualified to be an honor guard member, you have to be in good standing for one year and discipline discipline free. And, and you have to be physically fit to do the job, whether it be saluting, marching, uh, standing for prolonged periods of time. They have to be able to do complex routines uh, given the situation. And you have to be flexible with the schedule as well. In your daily performance of your duties, you have to be able to articulate that you exemplify integrity, you exemplify professionalism, and you exemplify honor. I, when I decided to become the, on the honor guard, I was in 2005, and I was a newly promoted sergeant, and I wanted to do something that Simplified what my training and education has already always uh, promoted, which was a man for others. And this is a good way to do it.